Right, this is trickier than I thought. I can't even undo the bloody screws. So, just as I was getting quite despondent with this side, because I've used far more than my daily ration of energy, I went around this side. And they've come out, so we're back on. So, that's the old one off. I'm gonna clean this up, and then we're gonna try and stick the new one back on. And this one doesn't look in too bad condition, but it's very soft. Very soft indeed. And the new ones are very hard indeed. He says, marking it already before it's even on the car. So, right, here we go again. Okay, so I've got the new bushing fitted on the other side. I still can't get these, these bolts out on this side, but we can hear what the difference is. That's kind of a shoom. There's a bit of a main clunk. Whereas this one, with the Just Send It personalized solid door bushings, now they're fitted and adjusted, this door sounds different. <laughs> when it closes. Yeah. So it takes a bit of a firmer, firmer shove, but I think for now I'm gonna reserve judgment until I've had a little drive. And I think if I carry on trying to do it, I'm probably going to bugger it up. So, uh, the hat doesn't help at all with a non-mechanic trying to do even the most basic mechanics. Unfortunately, that's probably why mechanics don't wear hats. So, uh, I'm going to clean up the oil <laughs> that I've tried to flood it with. Try and uh, lubricate them a bit. And then go back inside and lick my wounds, I guess. Um, but at least the other side feels more solid, so... I have to, uh, have to see how it goes. Why are you out in your car, guys, instead of sorting this door bushing? Well, I've just had to come and buy the world's most expensive socket wrench so that I can get the job done because I don't possess one. So, I got marked down on the man points, but I think I've just redeemed myself by spending too much on a socket wrench. So we'll go home and see if we can get the door done. Right, we're back home with the world's most expensive socket set. Well, well it's not even a set. I bought one socket and one ratchet. Hopefully, it's the golden ratchet. So, let's see. Magic. Right, this is the one. Yes, you beauty. Right, those bits of plastic on a car. However fantastic that plastic may be. Maybe need to tone down the excitement levels a little while I'm making a mess of this. Ta-da! Old one's gone. Give it a bit of clean up. I'd already put plenty of WD in there. They're pretty easy to clean. So, these scratches, I wonder if that's where the door's been bumping. So, that's clean. That's the knackered bush. Good. Thank you for your service, soldier. You're no longer required. Let's get the next one doing. I think pretty much the plan with these is that you get the 
How about this? Just send it.com by the way. Send fresh new bolts and washers with them. When I was shaking the box, I lost one of the washers. So I had to go back and find it. But I did because it was nice and shiny and fresh and new and not rusty and nasty like the old one. So Yogi Burr. To be fair, when I did when I went to the hardware store, just the other side of the car did feel stiffer. It was weird. It like it it, it felt half different. It was quite bizarre. So hopefully this one will make the difference complete. So I don't want to do it too tight because what that's got to do is fit into its corresponding part on the door in the car. So what they tend to do is get that roughly in place and then shut the door a few times. Fine. I'm going to tighten it up a little bit. Oh, see it move then. Oh, back. So I'm going to tighten it a little bit under the door again. That's nice. So we can tighten that off proper with the inbuilt torque wrench in my wrist I broke years ago blah 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 is the door still shut yep it's a much firmer shutting sound much more solid dunk so I'd imagine the door you know to get rattled a little bit more but I can sort that when I need to if I need to because the benefits that are reported. Look at me, trying to. Oh, I got it. Um, by all reports, these things are supposed to make quite a difference. And judging from the state of the old rubber ones, being a bit naff, and how solid these are, because that is proper. It's like nice, hard plastic. In fact, it's like. I don't know if they're cast or I don't imagine they're uh, printed because that's it's a damn nice finish that is there's no lines or anything and your doors can sound like this too so I'm the plan the reason why I've done this is because in a convertible car it's a bit like a skateboard and skateboards are flexible um, solid boxes are flexible is that the police on the chase again? Yep. Training out for the police. There's normally another one following. Um, yeah, but so the roof sort of solidifies the car a little bit when it's up, and I'm pretty sure it does. Um, but when the roof's down, the body kind of relies on the doors to be structural. So when they're flapping about with the old rubber bushes and sort of, and the doors twitching a bit, that twitching bends the, the front bulkhead and twists the car and stops the suspension from doing what it should do accurately. So it, only a little thing, but it, uh, it definitely, definitely felt a difference on that, doing that one side. So I would well imagine the second side was worth doing. I did contemplate making another driving video uh, to do a little review of the solid white door bushings that I got from justsenditdesigns.co.uk um, But I've decided just to talk to you instead because I realised that you're not going to be able to tell a damn thing from watching a in-car mounted camera <laughs> You're not going to be able to tell what's going on with it and what it feels like. so Because it's really subtle, but it's definitely a thing. The thing being is that the car feels a little bit newer, a little bit firmer. Um, then the rattles have gone from the door wells. Um, I've, got, I've got one rattle that's not appeared, but is the only remaining rattle. 
um, so on the door card somewhere I think but that was there before so the the just send it designs .co.uk solid door bushings have eliminated a lot of noise as far as driving the car um, it's a strange one they it just feels nicer uh, and newer and firmer I mean it's a 12 year old car as much as I love it it's a 12 year old car um, and it will be getting a little bit tired I guess um, but they've certainly smoothed out some of the wrinkles probably taken a few years off the age in feel wise through the steering wheel anyway so really pleased with them thanks to David um, hopefully I will try and get along to a show at some point um, and get a bit more involved in the community because people in their MX-5s keep waving at me now which is quite nice nobody cared about me driving them my dog knob red BMW as somebody once called it um, but the big smile on the front of this thing it's hard to be angry at it isn't it so I'm using the kudos of the car to try and <laughs> pretend I've got a personality and so far so good so yeah I just wanted to do this and get this video wrapped up and finished because tomorrow uh, I want to go for a drive so today uh, was it today no yesterday I fitted the um, door bushings today I went back to Honda um, in Shrewsbury JT Hughes and they have fitted for me two rear shock absorbers um, which has firmed up the ride a little bit uh, and got rid of two sort of nasty clunky rattles at the back end uh, so I'm gonna go and give it a drive tomorrow and see see what's going on with it uh, but like I said I just wanted to get this one wrapped up uh, um, 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 don't really know what else to say so that's probably you know <laughs>